Hey guys, it's Jessica. So today I'm going to be talking about a Louis Vuitton repair item that we had serviced and the reason why I didn't put it in with one of my previous videos where I showed you guys this bag that I just also got repaired. The reason why I wanted to do a separate video is because I have a little bit more information on this item i also wanted to show you guys pictures i wanted to show you guys just like the issues that we had with this item so if you guys are interested keep on watching okay so back in may i went to the louis vuitton repair uh place in south coast plaza and i did drop off this wallet which is my husband's pocket organizer i don't know um the type of leather this is maybe you guys do i think it's in the emprunt um i could be wrong but we decided to get this one reglazed because the glazing was starting to not melt but rub off a lot so my husband wanted to go ahead and fix this and so we dropped off the wallet and we also dropped off my bag this one was done on time in november so it's supposed to be done in november and it was done in november and actually it was done before november and he had this in his own account and i had my bag in my own account if you guys watched that video i had issues with the c8 not working there anymore and the transfer of the account i don't know what happened but the point is that this one didn't have the same issue i don't know why because it was the same ca that helped him and helped me so it was a little weird but besides that um so what we wanted to get done was the glazing so as you guys can see the glazing has been fixed um it has a thick black glazing now all around the wallet i hope you guys can see that um and yeah the wallet looks good it is well loved because my husband used to use this a lot and as you guys know with the emprunt leather um it tends to kind of the, the like the raising like the little uh pattern it tends to fade off after a while it's not in perfect condition but it is well used and well loved especially from here from the corners the um the glazing was rubbing off from here in the corners and it just looked really bad and before it started to like crack which i don't know if the actual leather cracks too this is really soft leather so i'm not completely sure if this would crack but just to avoid anything because he does he does have um another wallet that's canvas and that one if you don't fix the glazing it does crack the canvas but leather i don't think that happens to it but i could be wrong so they said that they were going to charge him 120 dollars for this item to be reglazed let's fast forward to december because the wallet was ready before november but he didn't get contacted by anybody which was weird i remember i told him hey do you want to call in because they don't give me any information because it's under his name so i told him do you want to call in and ask to see if your wallet is ready because it's been a while it's supposed to be ready in november so he calls in and they told him yeah it's been ready so i don't know the communication at south coast plaza needs to get better i think um but they end up telling him that his wallet is ready so he was so excited he's like okay i'm gonna go so he ends up going to the lv store i didn't end up going with him because i had so many things to do that day so he went by himself and when i tell you that he sent me pictures and i was so upset i am going to pull up pictures here on what this wallet looked like when my husband went so I don't know if you guys can see this white circle here. This was worse. And when we dropped it off, it didn't have any of this. So the wallet was used. And as you guys can see, like it's not in perfect condition. You know, you can tell that it's been used and loved. But it did not have this white circle. I don't know what this is. It didn't have that. The picture that he sent me looked 
terrible and they were trying to say that we took it that way i was like no definitely not because if if the wallet would have been in that condition they would have written it down on the notes my husband is very quiet my husband is he he doesn't like problems he'd rather just stay quiet and i am the complete opposite i'm like no definitely not the wallet was not like that when we dropped it off and i'm gonna try to post a picture of what the notes said if we would have dropped it off with that big of a stain inside that would have been written down on the notes but it was not it would have stated on the paperwork there there was the inside of it was stained that way so right away i told him i'm gonna send you a picture of the paperwork because it does not state on there and i also want you to ask them to pull up the notes from when they received the item because they take notes when they receive the items in wherever they ship them to i don't know where it is if they ship it to france wherever it may be when they receive the piece they take their own notes on what the item looked like and she looked at the notes the ca that helped us did not write white stains on the inside and when they received it at the facility where they were going to repair it they didn't have that in their notes either so at this point i'm like well what the hell happened and my husband like i said he's very kumbaya so he really didn't want to make a big deal out of it but i wanted to know what happened because if i give them an item and if i don't receive it the same way or better than what i gave them what is going on what did they put on it what did they stain it with what is that i wanted answers first of all it's just in my nature to be so pushy like that and ask for answers i kept on telling him ask them what happened ask them to look so um they told him that they were going to contact the facility they were going to ask what happened and that if they had to um condition the leather that they were going to do that and that they were going to charge him and i'm like no no they are not going to charge you for something that you didn't do they did that but i was just here on the phone like no 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 and i i should have gone i should have gone with him but i didn't they told him that they were going to send it back ask what happened figure it out and that they will let us know so my husband ends up leaving the wallet behind. He did not pay $120. He just left it behind and that was it. I think a week or two weeks after, he gets a call back and they, the CA that was helping him ends up sending him a video. And I'll go ahead and post it here. She sent him a video of what the wallet looked like now. And she also said that he was more than welcome to come into the store, check it out. And if he thought it was how he left it, that, you know, he can take the wallet. So the wallet in the video looks really good. So I told him, okay, it looks great. You couldn't really see the white rings anymore, but now it's been a few weeks and the rings are coming back. So if you guys happen to know what these rings are and what causes this white stain here and here, can you guys please let me know because i don't know and they said they had no idea all they did was clean it but as you guys can see it's coming back so i don't know if i should go back and try to figure out what happened maybe some of you guys that buy the leathers know what this is because i have no idea they didn't end up charging him for the glazing they didn't charge him anything they were just like here sorry you know we messed up i guess because they were like free of charge don't worry about it and they gave it to him and he was like okay and it looked good but now i can see those white circles coming back so now i am frustrated um i'm not sure if you guys have a recommendation on how we can take that off should we take that off should we take it back to louis what should we do because it's, it's a little frustrating now that i've opened it again and now that i see that it's coming back i'm gonna do my own research but if you guys have had 
this same issue please let me know that is what happened with the repair on this lv piece i am a little upset because you know you leave your pieces so they can repair them and make them better and then you get it and it's not better and it just sucks but yeah that is the update on this repair i hope you guys enjoyed this video as always thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to comment share and subscribe i will see you guys in the next one bye